A Bobo's Big Adventure. Anyone who's pl played, grew, grew up playing the Nintendo games in the 80s, 90s, love this game. It's a tribute to the NES. Best thing is you can play right on your computer for free. Go to abobosbigadventure.com. Use the arrow keys to move. Use the A and S buttons to attack. In the year 1985, the Nintendo Entertainment System was created. It brought much joy to people all around the world. But one NES character never got a chance to share a story until now. See, every time we play, they got different characters down there. Anyways, you're playing as a Bobo from the game Double Dragon on the NES. You got 10 stages. Each stage is from a different NES game. And they got tons of characters from different games. And you get these medals too. Like I got the Patience Medal for waiting through that intro. Go to the level select. There I got a medal for choices. See, instead of using the keyboard, I bought the retro link adapter so I could plug my NES controller into the USB port. And here's the first stage is like Double Dragon. They kidnapped his son. It's really cool too, they got the way they made the strategy in this game. You have to kind of practice a lot to learn what to do. So I got another medal for waiting through that intro. Poor bold boy. It's cool, you get all kinds of medals in all these stages, which is fun. Anyways, we're not gonna use the arrow keys or the keyboard buttons. I got the controller. Turn the volume up a little bit because the music's kind of hard to hear. And that rage meter you see at the bottom of the screen, every time I hit them, it goes up. If I get hit, it goes down. When I get full rage, I press the A and B button on the controller. There's a Goomba. And it attacks everything on the screen. I usually like to save that rage for bad, like, whoops. Okay, there I got another metal for running. Now that refills your health when you eat that guy's head, but I had full health anyway. comes a TNC surf design guy. I'm gonna be ready to kick him. Now this guy come on up here that's got the nunchucks. You wanna run and hit him. Like that. Kill him. You gotta dodge these barrels. Those Goombas can't hurt you either. Oh, that was nasty. Once you clear the screen of bad guys, the ladders come down. Oh! Go back down the ladder. Kick. Donkey Kong Jr. You Kong Kong. Punk punk metal. I hate, that's the this arrows are really touchy. Okay, 
take up full rage, but I'm gonna save it. You're gonna get Beardy Barrel, that barrel up there at the top of the screen, it's gonna come alive. I'm gonna save it for him. the spies from Spy vs. Spy. That's a kid from River City Ransom. Check this out. Now I'm going to use my rage. And he takes one more hit to kill him now. See, that guy's hard to beat. That's why I use my rage. He refilled my health. I don't know who these guys are. You can go up this thing here. There's the Super Mario clan getting whipped by the Devil Dragon Girls. Sorry, this is a private party. Here's the final boss of this stage. He'd be kind of tricky, you just want to stay really close to him. You don't want to be in the line of fire because they'll start shooting at you. So you just want to stay really close to him and keep punching. Hitting and moving. One more hit should do it. I've never gotten through this entire game without dying. I've come really close though before. There's some stages that are really hard to get, get through, but... Moon Fight stage is the first one where I struggle. I don't know what scene this is from. Next stage is Super Mario Brothers though. Tapping the A button. And you swim just like in Super Mario Brothers. You got a tongue like Yoshi. Just pick these enemies up and shoot them at each other. There's the fish from Mega Man 2. Oh. Shows antenna three times without getting hit. Oh. Oh, I guess you, you can't get hit like oh. right there. I did. This door right here, like Super Mario Brothers door. Now you get this mermaid Annie. If you choose mate, you get like a shield which you can use up to ten hits. When you get hit with that shield, it doesn't count against your rage or your health. There's some medals you can't get, but see, you choose that one, you get a medal. If I were to choose the wrong one, I'd get a separate medal. So, I mean, it's impossible to get every medal in one playthrough. You'd have to go back and play again to get them all. There's my shield. Oh. See, my rage keeps going up when I hit them, but it doesn't go down when I get hit. 
seaweed from Ninja Turtles. She already lost one of the kids. One hit him three times. If you hit one of his bubbles, it doesn't count. Okay, I'm going to use my full rage. So you get a medal each time you use your rage for the first time in each level. I still had a bubble in my mouth. There's Karnoff. That character I'm not familiar with. This is the only game I've seen him in, but I know he's in the game. So I've heard, of, heard about him before. Once again, you gotta hit, hit him three times. There's a lot of characters in this game you gotta hit three times. Or I should say a lot in this level. Here comes Jaws from the game Jaws. LJN game. LJN published a lot of terrible games. You just want to hit him three times. level urban champs you cannot get beat in this one first I'm gonna let him hit me so I get a medal Press any button, you get to do a fatality. But if you wait, you can do this code here. You do friendship. Now 
that was that scene there, the friendship and the fatalities from Mortal Kombat. I didn't come out till the Super Nintendo, so I don't know why they put that in this game. The rest of it's all Nintendo. And we got this level, level four, which is the Zelda's Le Legend of Zelda. Kill all the bad guys to open this door. You don't have full health, you don't have the pro projectile sword. You just have the sh sword that you shoot out. Block one of the racks and you get the block the rack metal. Full rage, but I'm gonna save. There's two characters in this stage. I like to use my rage on. I guess actually three of them. Get the map. Get another metal. Whoa, that was close. Can be tricky. Whenever you walk in their path, they cl close on you. But I want to get in that hole down there, so I do this. Sometimes I get hit. Get this thing here, and that allows me to walk on one block of water. And I'll show show what I mean by that. I can walk out like one block worth of water, but I can't go up to the next block of water. I had to go back off and then back on. But you need that in order to get any further in this game. See, when you kill all the bad guys in one room, when you come back to that room, they won't be there. If you only kill like half the guys, or let's say a few of the guys, you don't kill all of them. When you come back, all of them will be there again. Here's the room I started in. So now, if I were to let that guy live and I left the room, when I came back, all the same, all the bad guys would be back. You have to kill them all to have, to have the rooms remain empty when you return. Shy guy, shy guys from Super Mario Bros. 2. This room I just skip right through. This guy you don't do not want him to touch you. You don't want to go near him. near him, he'll shoot out this cord and blow you up like a balloon, and you gotta walk away from these enemies without getting popped if you get touched. It's one hit death. Just 
first I got my full rage meter. Hopefully I don't get hit. So if I get hit, I'll lose some of my rage. There's one character I want to save before this. There's a couple areas in this game. The flurries from Super Mario Bros. 2 are in this game, and they are just as annoying in this game as they were in Super Mario Bros. 2. And when you go through this door, there's going to be an enemy right inside, so you want to shoot right away. Bomb, if you go up near him and stab him, you get the idiot achievement medal. But you also lose some health, and I don't want to do that quite yet. There's another one in the game we'll get the medal for. Get that beef. 
you don't have full health and you get the speed, it refills your health all the way up. Now I'm going to hit that bomb. Um, cool, I got back far enough so it didn't hurt me. I still got the metal too. Okay, now up here you got these ghosts to fight, and they are tough. See, it's like impossible to hit them without getting hit. Very rare do I ever get lucky. But you know, it's like they cheat the gang up on you and give you pretty much a no-win situation. And see now, you notice I'm not getting hearts. I just killed like five of them and didn't get a heart. See, I don't have my projectiles. So, I'm not gonna fight these guys. Him, I'm not gonna fight until I get the projectile power back. Which might be a while. I need some hearts. There, I got one. If you kill 50 guys in this level, you get an uh, anger management award. So I'm going to want to get my rage up again for the flurries which are in that room down at the bottom. There's some guys up here I can kill though. And There I got my projectiles. Oops. Now I want to get my rage back. Yeah, with the beef, it kills those things in one hit. Across water thing can also go across the lava. 
Most of it's just orange water. Anyways, here's the final boss. You got three forms to beat. First, you want to destroy the blue things, otherwise, they generate shield around them. I had to use it. The bomb was about to hit me. Okay, now how did I get hit? I used full rage. The bomb should not have been able to touch me. See, the flames always come towards you too, so it's like impossible. It splits up. And it gives you a hit. You, they don't even give you a chance to get out of the way. I hate, I hate games that cheat. I don't necessarily hate games that cheat. I just hate when games cheat. So I love this game. I just hate it when they put you in a situation where you can't even defend yourself. I mean, imagine playing, like, Super Mario Brothers. And there's a stage where you start over the lava, and you just fall right in and die. Okay, here's the last one. Now, there's a pattern to this guy when he stomps. Stand to the sides. Second time, stand to the diagonal. Third time's a bunch of rocks just... Come on, give me a chance. Stomping is completely random too, you never know when he's going to stomp. Oh. Kill him right here. And he's going go in here. stage was kind of long. I'm hoping to be able to get this whole game done in one video. I think this is the end of the game playing for the first time. No, we're only halfway through. We're not even halfway through it.
can't remember now if there's ten, ten stages, ten levels, or nine. I, I could have sw Oh yeah, there's nine. Okay. This next, that was level four right there, and the next one is level nine. I think I said ten stages at the beginning of the video, I'm at nine. Balloon fight. This is the one that's hard. This is where I'll probably die for the first time. There are a couple times I got through this whole stage without dying, but it's really tough. At the beginning, I'm going to stay towards the bottom of the screen so I can hit this ape and get a medal. Stay away from those things, those things kill you in one hit. Most other things, I just pop your balloon and it takes two hits. Now my rage, I'm going to use it when I need it. Guess the tougher enemies are also from about to get hit. They get an achievement for hitting them in the head the, for the first time. I had to use it because I was kind of going right in the area towards the stars. Yeah, those blooms fill up quite a bit of your health, or your rage. See if you can hit... Oh, this guy is an idiot. He's just as bad in this game he was in Super Mario Brothers. Lakitu, Lakitu, however you pronounce it. Those are the actual characters from Balloon Fight. If you can hit him right away, you can avoid him shooting at him. I did have one balloon pop, but I gained it back, and I haven't died yet, so that's pretty cool. Whoa! That was close. You got the Excite Bike characters, which are annoying. Another one, and they're kind of unpredictable. You don't know where they're gonna go. That was really close. this achievement for hitting them right away. If I wouldn't have gotten them, we would have had all these little reapers. And I'd have to try to outrun them. And if you do outrun them, you get a different achievement for that. Yeah, you want to keep tapping A to stay at the top of the screen. It's 
still got full rage. This is a good time to use it. Oh, it might not hit on the cash yet. My main boss there is the Amazon. If he's blocking another enemy from my shots, it won't hit him. I think we might have made it to the end of the stage. bad guys left. Yep, here it is, the end. I made it all the way through without dying. That would be cool. See, I hate this predictability. Nice try, Bobo, but my jetpack will never run out of fuel. And then all of a sudden, sputs, but it runs out. See, I got the Balloon Master achievement for getting through it without dying. I hate that predictable humor, though. When they say something in the complete opposite happens. Look at there's... Jason Voorhees, there's Gizmo, there's Noid, there's Ryu from Ninja Gaiden, there's Simon Belmont from Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest. We got a boy in his blob, I don't know what the yellow character is, I don't know what the skeleton character is. And that blue thing in the bottom right corner. There's the dog from Duck Hunt that everyone hates. Look at that pro tip, press 1 during balloon fight to skip the boss, so you could actually press 1 in the balloon fight stage and skip it, but you're missing the fun. This one is from the game Pro Wrestling. See, you want to do all the wrestling moves to get an achievement. Oh cool, here's another one you can get. Pick up the chair and hit him. Now if you can hit him with all four chairs, you get another achievement. See it, you press back and A to do that move, press forward and A to do the first move I did, press up and A to do another one, and down and A for another one. See, if you get, I've never been able to do the all four chairs one. Punch the camera in, get a medal. Okay, there I did the suplex, now I gotta do down and A, and I got, did all four of the girl wrestling moves. I thought I did all four of them. Up an A. Try down an A. Okay, I've been, done all the moves, but I didn't get a medal. There I did. There I got it. Forward and B. Beat this guy for another medal. Oh, I forgot about this one. Come up here, fool. Oh, I got full rage already. A winner is me. And that's funny because it when whenever you'd win in the game pro wrestling, it'd say a winner is you. Here they're making fun out of the title pro wrestling there weren't any real pro professional wrestlers in the game. There were a bunch of characters just made up by the game. And now here you got pro professional wrestlers like the Ultimate Warrior. You got Rowdy Roddy Piper, The Undertaker, and Hulk Hogan. They're all going to do their special moves. 
I think this is probably the best I've ever done on this stage. I still got half my health. Usually our health stays pretty close all the way down to the end. I spend my Valentine's Day playing the game I love. Here's Bobo's final move. Seven, Mega Man 2, stage from Mega Man 2. This is one of my favorites. This one was a really tough one. I get through these through the game without dying. This guy from character from Bubble Bobble. I don't know who that punk comes from. The blast. Oh, Zevios up there. I hate those things. I usually use my rage on those things. I think Cranky is from DuckTales. Here's the hardest part of the stage, avoiding these lasers. It's one, one hit death. That was really close. Now I don't have to worry. I can beat the rest of the stage without dying. I just can't believe I made it past that last laser. Because it, usually if you delay at all on those moves, you get killed. the stage. He's pretty easy once you get his pattern down. He 
you get two forms to the fight. I gotta fight another boss. And then cheat it again. You know, sometimes you. Here's where he can move. You get hit by those spikes from the ceiling. It's one hit death. Kill them. Mega Mash for beating him. The Mega Master for making it all the way through without dying. Boy, boy, bull boy currently being transported through jungle. Objective: prevent a bull, bull from proceeding to jungle. Mission failed. Error, error. Johnny number five is alive. Need input. System shut down. Bunch of stuff. This next stage is my favorite of the whole game. Contra. And that's the one game I've never played as a kid was Contra. One game I'd, I've still never played. Now I just gotta get through this stage without dying. One hit death in this stage. I shouldn't have used it right now. I should have waited until taxi. See, I should have waited until taxi that was, that was on the screen. Whoa. Fire's better than the lemmings. The only reason I got it was for the metal. Whoa, that was really close. I'm getting lucky here. Robocop. Stay close to him. You have to be 
careful where you use your rage too. Sometimes you'll jump down when you're using it. So I might as well use it like where I'm in a place where I know I'm safe. Jump over that guy because his head touches you, you die. The sprite is the best, best weapon you can get. Watch out for this Jason character. I don't want fire, so I'm not gonna get that. firing at this guy here. Crying from, crying from Ninja Turtles. Okay, now I gotta fight the middle boss. There's like two parts of the stage. Right now I'm at the half, the midway point. After I beat this boss here, I'll be at the midway point. This guy wants to stay low. First I want to destroy his arm. Next his head. Next I want to destroy his head. Kirby. I get the Super Soldier Award for making it halfway through without dying, and I get the Clang Bang for beating him. And I move on to the second half of this stage. So if I could just get through the second half without dying, this would be the first time. In the last stage, I can get easily get through without dying. that we see in the stage, they are from... I think it's... Ghosts and Goblins.
okay, Ryu, you just want to stay way back here. I wasn't planning to use my rage, but I was hitting both buttons at the same time, so. No big deal, though. I, I don't like using rage against the final boss in this game, because... It's kind of distracting. That was Stinger from the game Stinger. I don't know what Tarot Drop is from. Okay, now we got the final boss coming up. When he's got a pattern, you just gotta watch it. When he's sucking in, you wanna. You don't want to be directly under him. It's Kirby, by the way. And while he's stepping in, he's, there's going to be things coming towards you. you got to jump over him. You just want to keep shooting up at him. See, so he has to run and jump over that thing. Okay, now you got to watch for the shadow because he's going to drop as a rock. Stay out of the way. Next he's going to shoot flames. Once again he's going to be inhaling. Okay, now would be a good time to use it. Hero achievement for beating the whole stage without dying. I got the Packer Bobo God. No, the first one I got for beating the second half. The Packer Bobo God I got for beating the whole stage without dying. And that last one I got for beating Kirby. And this is going to be the first time I've ever beating, beaten the entire game without dying. Because this next stage I always beat without dying. Wait, I know who has a bow boy. After I finished training him, little Mac went all power crazy and used his skills for evil. Now he's kidnapped your son to prove to the world of any ass that nobody can stop him. Your only hope of defeating Little Mac is to let me train you. So what do you say, a bobo? See Doc there and Little Mac that he's talking about are from the game Mike Tyson's Punch Out. That's a game I always just ran as a kid. Final boss, Mike Tyson's Punch-Out. If you played Mike Tyson's Punch-Out a lot, the one thing you gotta keep in mind is that you're not Little Mac in this game, you're a Bobo, so you're fighting on the opposite side. And there's a very specific pattern. When he, you wanna wait for Little Mac to swing at you, you wanna dodge it, then punch him, do a straight punch, the jab, and that'll stun him. Then I start, I can do four uppercuts while he's dazed and just keep doing that over and over. Wait for him to swing and dodge it.
he gets up, he can jab again. And now I got full rage, so I can knock him down the third time just by pressing A and B. But check this out what he does first. This is cool. I got for... Okay, it's so bad I got for beating him. I'm the greatest I got for beating him in... I think for beating him without getting knocked down, or beating him in the first round. I think it's without getting knocked down, and I think I got champ for beating him in the first round. Join the Nintendo Fun Club today, man. Ghosts and Goblins. Karate Champ, I believe. I think that's from the game Metroid, but I'm not sure. I've never played that game, but I've seen part of it. And the music sounds like it's from it. RC Pro Am. Tetris. Tecmo Bowl. I've played that many, many times when I was younger. Tetris is another one I've also played a lot. I have no idea what this game is. Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest, one of my favorites. Rampage, I'm not sure if I've played the NES version of Rampage. I have played the N64 version. And of course, last but not least, Super Mario Brothers. Anybody who's had Nintendo played Super Mario Brothers. That's the first time in my entire life I've beaten this game on one life. Never died throughout the entire game. I'm so glad I got it recorded. I actually wasn't planning to upload this video to YouTube, I was just going to have it because I've already uploaded this game so many times, like three times on YouTube, but since this is the first time I beat it, I just figured, well, might as well. I got the music from Super Mario Bros. 2. Mario Brothers 2 was a dream. Here's the part of the game that I really don't understand when they show the credits. Half the characters they show were not in the game. It's like, I don't know if it's supposed to be funny. I mean, they could have at least put all the characters that were in the game. Okay, like Shooter Gavin, he was in the game. Zod from Superman was not. I have no idea who Ivan or Yvonne Drago is. Mega Shark we seen. There's Soundwave from Transformers. Not in the game. 
Galactus. I have no idea who he was. I have no idea who the Flaming Carrot is. There's Urban Champ. We've seen him. Domo Kun. Have no idea who he is. I've seen it. Seen it picture of that thing before. Skeletor from He-Man. There's an old man who's seen. Squiggly Fish is actually named Trouder. There's the Fonz. I don't know what he's doing here. The Amazon. We beat him in pro wrestling. There's Gumby who didn't, did not appear in the game. Freddy Krueger was not in the game. Robo Bobo was. Doc Brown from Back to the Future was not in the game. Inspector Gadget was not in the game. Kirby, we beat him. Guybrush, Threepwood, have no idea who he is. There's Clark W. Griswold, who did not make an appearance. Papa Smurf was not in the game either. There's Little Mac, who we defeated at the end. There's a bull boy. The Bobo. I think these are the writers of the game or the creators, the developers, Nick Pasto, Ox Power, and Roger Barr. And those are probably all the people that helped create it. watching the ending. Best ending ever. And we're going to take a look at the medals. <laughs> give up, you have to use a continue, but I didn't even die. Bloody Bobo is if you don't continue, you let him die, and it shows me cut up with a saw. Duck Hunted, Secret to Everybody, Headbangers, the Secret to Everybody, I never got those. Bobo Battle, never had, we got Best Aiming Ever, never had Luck Dragon, we got Beardy Basher, we got the Forklift Foul, Child Chopper, Run a Bobo Run, Cry for Party, Ironic, you, I got that the last time I played. He knocked the belt, he knocked the boss off the conveyor, but he jumps back up, so you don't actually beat him. I got the Kong Punt. I got the Waste Knot. I got Rocky Rage. See, bad call. You can only get that if you don't get Mirbo Boys. Get Bloody Chum, which I got. I got the Bigger Boat. I got the Call of Plumber. I did not get a Bubble Appetizers. You got to eat at least 50 enemies in level in the water level. Never got Thriller, never got Fish Foods where you get eaten by a shark, or a robo fish. I got Typhoon Time, I got Friendly Foes, No Mercy would be if I used the Fatality instead of the Friendship move. Fighting Chance I got, I got Meat Spin, I did not get Police Patrol, you have to wait long enough for a cop car to drive by, but that's an Urban Champ, I don't want to sit there wait forever. Elderly Execution, beat the boss with LP, I've never done that. Locked Rock I got, I got Anger Issues, I got another castle, I got mm, Beefy. I got Where To, I got Walk On Water, I got Familiar Shape. I did not get Slowpoke, because if you turned into a snail, it's hard to get away from getting popped. Die Dragon Die I got, I got Manhandled, I got Flurry Frag, I got Kill the Messenger, I got Pushy, I got Projectile Power. I never got sneaky. I got idiot. Oh, no fatty pops, the one you get where you gotta get away from Dig Dug after he blows up into a balloon. I got Super Slash. I got the Bonkers. I did not get Reaper Runner. You can only get Reaper Runner if I don't get Reap this, but I did get the Reap this. 
I got a winner is me, I got Pro Wrestler, I got Risky, got No Filming, got Bloodsport, got Surf's Up, got Looney. Did not get Balloon Jedi. He has survived the balloon fight level without being hit. I got hit like two or three times. I got Balloon Master, I got Death Blossom, I got Have a Seed. I did not get Chair Massacre where you have to use all four chairs. I've never gotten that yet before. I got Mega Mash. I got Skynet Stopper. I did not get Laser Tag, which is good because that's where you get hit by a laser and you get killed. Jason Lives, I did get that before. That's when you shoot that airplane out of the air. If that little Jason character gets away, then you get the Jason Lives one. But I usually use my Rage and destroy them both. I got the extra bobo, I got the Mega Master for beating the whole stage without dying. I got Mega Blast. I did not get Icy Escape. I got Turtle Power. I got Crang Bang. I got Fury Furry. Or Fiery Fury. I get Oh, Flame Gun, okay. I got the Lemming Lunacy. I got the Auto Assault. I got Spread the Love. I got Robopop. I got Barfarama. I got Soap on a Dope. I got Contra Bobo God. I got Super Soldier. I got War Hero. And then I got Fire Bad. I did not get Double Trouble. I got Bombs Away. I didn't have to use the code, but although I haven't done it before, you press up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, and you get like tons of lives. That's if you, you have, first you have to die three times in uh, Contra level. I got Champ, I got I'm the Greatest, I got Mac Attack. So Champ you get by defeating Little Mac around one. I'm the Greatest you get by defeating Little Mac without being knocked down at all. I got It's So Bad, I got Punchy Power. Everybody get thanks that acid bath, bath is where you get beat in uh, punch out round. Okay, so let's see how many I got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, sixty, sixty-one, sixty-two, sixty-three, sixty-four, sixty-five, sixty-six, sixty-seven, sixty-eight, sixty-nine, seventy, seventy-one. So I got seventy-one medals. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching me beat the entire game on one life. I'll see you in the next video.